What is a man Whitney U test? A man Whitney U test tests whether there is a difference between two independent samples. An example. Is there a difference between the reaction time of women and men? But the t-test for independent samples does the same. It also tests whether there is a difference between two independent samples. The man with the u-test is the non-parametric counterpart to the t-test for independent samples. The t-test for independent samples tests whether there is a mean difference. For both samples, the mean value is calculated and it is tested whether these mean values differ significantly. The man with the u-test checks whether there is a rank sum difference. For this purpose, we sort all persons from the smallest to the largest value. This person has the smallest value, so gets rank 1. This person has the second smallest value, and so on and so forth. Then we can simply add up the ranks of the first group and the second group. Now we can investigate whether there is a significant difference between these rank sums. The advantage of taking the rank sums rather than the difference in means is that the data need not to be normally distributed. So in contrast to the t-test, the data in the man with new u-test do not have to be normally distributed. What are the hypotheses of the man with new u-test? The null hypothesis is, in the two samples, the rank sums do not differ significantly. The alternative hypothesis is, in the two samples, the rank sums do differ significantly. 